What's going on guys and girls? We're here playing some more of The Witness and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to complete the monastery section and you will then end up getting the monastery trophy at the end of this. So that's what we're going to be doing. So we are currently in the keep. This is the last one that we just completed and so from the keep you want to head out this way. On the right of us would be the shady trees and on the left of us is the marsh area just so you have a, an idea of exactly where we are and you just want to head over here to the these red trees over here inside this little area this is the monastery so just head across this bridge and then turn around so that you can get on the other side so that you actually can get inside the monastery area and once you get over here you'll be able to see it I'm just gonna back up once I get over here so you guys can see get a good view of where exactly we are so this is the monastery right here so if you can you can have a look around if you want and what we're going to do is we're just going to head up here and there are a few little panels very simple ones just to open the doors so just draw the line across there and that will open one of the set of the doors and then you have to do this other one over here to open the other set of doors and that will allow you to go inside now once you're inside you can see there's a big tree in the middle if you go to the back area so those panels are the ones we want to open so if you go to the back area over here there's a little uh, tree over here on a little platform and there's a puzzle on it and what you want to do is you want to open that side so depending on which side of the uh, tree you're standing on will change the way that you will open so the sides of the monastery all open up if you're facing this way it will be those front ones in front of us and these ones will close up and the front ones in front of us will open up so we can see the puzzle so you can actually move them around you can change each side so you have to do this side so that you can get the puzzles completed uh, these are the ones that activate the the laser the other ones don't really do anything that I know of so far so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna line this up so you can actually line this up really nicely and get a good view of exactly what you need to do so that is the pathway for that puzzle you can actually draw it from inside here uh, I didn't really think of that at the time so there's there's also this one right here so you can actually draw this one as well from the inside once you get in the right position so that there and you can just follow the outside if you don't want to draw it from inside here what you can do is you can take a photo like I was doing and then when you go outside you'll be able to see it properly so when we go outside we're just going to complete those first two puzzles and the third one right here is backwards it's actually blocked so you actually can't see it from inside but you have to remember that you are now looking at a mirrored image when you're on the other side on this side of the uh the wall so here we're just going to draw that first pattern it was kind of like a lightning bolt very simple and easy one to do that will unlock the second panel right here and what we want to do is we just want to follow whatever that shape was that was before so we're just going to go up here a little bit and then go like that then just get that square out of there and then another little square right before the end so that will unlock the third panel now remember you have to do that reverse thinking so for this one you want to uh, place the thing right there and then you want to go to your which way is it to your left to your right sorry and then you come to the left and then you come to the right and then you go down to the finish and that is those three panels so that will unlock this little gateway over here so you can go through there if you wanted to and then if you go back the other way you can't actually get through the other gate until you do it a little bit more but you don't really need that for this one and you come back this way and you can go this way so it also unlocked this panel inside of the monastery so if you just come in here you can see this panel is now unlocked and those ones are still dark so so as you can see that's the cable that goes across and we're just going to line this up over here so now you have to use the trees branches so as you can see the branches and the leaves have now created a pathway like that so now we can use that pathway to get through so you just have to avoid the leaves and the tree just like when we were doing the shady tree section instead of using the shadows you're actually looking through the branches and that is the gaps that you have to use so now we have to line this one up in the right spot you actually use these branches on this side so you just line them up good enough so you can get a good pathway now we just have to draw that you can draw it like this or you can move out of the way and draw it I just find it easier if you draw it while that pathways there because then you just have to follow it you don't have to take a picture and try and remember and 
overlay it on stuff on your mind. So now that that one's complete, that will unlock the next panel. These panels over here uh, use the opposite uh, thinking. So what you have to do is you have to line it up so that the branches actually are the lines that you want to use. So just like in the shady tree one, you were avoiding the shadows and then you were using the shadows. This is the same thing. So we avoided the branches. Now we actually have to use the branches. So this one, you will have to take like a picture or draw it down or just use your memory. And then you have to just complete it when you have to move out of the way so you can do that. So this is the shape that you have to use. Now there are a couple of lines in that that are like misleading lines but they lead to nowhere so you can easily tell which ones to use. Now this last panel here I actually had to look up and I still don't understand how you get the middle section. Maybe there are some other branches that I could never figure out to line up but I had to look this one up because I just couldn't get that uh, bottom half of that section completed. I just didn't know what was happening because there's no branches there. So if you guys know exactly where you have to be to that, feel free to let me know. Send me a picture or something. And this is what we're going to do. We're just going to go like this. I had to look this one up. It was so frustrating. I spent ages trying to figure it out. And then you just go down like this. So that last little bit, I just couldn't find, figure out how to get that. And once you've done that, that will unlock this part outside. And then that will be basically the end of this section. So once you go out here, you just want to run around here. You can even use the run button. And you can see that's the cable coming across there. And it comes down to this part. And this is actually where the laser comes out of. So we're just going to do that last little puzzle. And that should unlock the trophy and the laser. So there's the trophy there, monastery, and that's all you really have to do for this video. So thank you guys for watching, hope you've enjoyed it. Now it's time for me to say see you guys and girls. Hopefully you guys have now got all of the trophies yourself, well at least these ones that we've done so far. And yeah, so we're just going to let this finish off, and I'm just going to say see you guys and girls and see you in the next video.